<laughs> Hi guys, welcome to LS10 TV, uh, the new format of how we're going to be getting news out to you guys from LS10. Hope everyone had a great Christmas and New Year and is ready to tackle 2022. We can leave 2021 in the past. It was yeah, go on. No. 2022, going to be a brilliant year. Yeah. And what did we do in 2021? We had the scooter competition. Well, the Wham Bam oh, Scooter was, Jam. Yeah. yeah, we had the Wham Bam <laughs> Scooter Jam. The Express Yourself Skate Jam. Summer camps, Halloween camps, and Christmas camps. What are we doing in 2022? I don't know. <laughs> Hopefully, another scoot jam, another skateboard jam. I try and get a lot more done this year, maybe even a couple of jams and competitions. You guys can let us know in the comments what you'd like us to do. Um, trick tips as well, more trick tips coming up, more features, uh, more edits, just loads of rad skating and scooter riding and BMXing. So this is an opportunity for you guys to tell us what you think you would like to see in the skate park. Um, we're gonna go to a brand new trick tip with Hugo Bateman. We're gonna to drop into a ramp. Yeah. Honestly, I don't, I don't think about dropping in though. I could literally do it with my eyes closed right now. So, when dropping in on a scooter on a ramp, you wanna have your scooter placed like so. Place both feet on, and when you lean forward, it's gonna feel like you're basically just gonna fall flat on your face, but trust me, you're not. Slowly, you're gonna lean forward and you're gonna smash your front wheel down pretty much. And your back wheel's gonna lift up a little bit just to get over the metal coping. And now I'll kind of demonstrate how to do it now. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> When dropping in, but obviously just a beginner, you're just starting, the easier way is probably to drop in by having your feet like this and pushing yourself off, kind of almost like you're doing it, uh, literally pushing on the floor. But when you're doing it, you want to lean forward just a tiny bit and the main key is you've got to bend your knees. Because if you don't bend your knees and you keep them straight, what's gonna happen is the transition is gonna loop you backwards and you're kind of fall on your bum. It kind of hurts a little bit. Oh, that was rubbish, I'll do it again. <laughs> 